What is up, everybody? Angry World Cup Gaming here. We are back with another episode of the Dozen Dwarf Remote. It's actually been six months. Yeah, I'm not joking with you guys. It's been six months since I actually done this save. Like, look at this. I was actually trying to start other saves. And I, I get bored of them, but maybe I just gotta... Look, look at that date. 27th of 22. 22. Yep, that's literally, it's literally been since last year since I touched this save. It's crazy enough to think... It's been since last year I touched the same. And then this is this is the squad. I I don't remember anything. I, I generally do not remember anything. But <laughs> we're gonna get into this. Um I don't know like who who's the best and who's the worst at, at this point. So we're just gonna go with my guts here. Um still gonna use Sofifa, but we are out of the transfer window. So how is this gonna work? We're gonna only play like up to the January transfer window. So we're going to play probably like I don't know like two games. So one, uh, the we're gonna do like highlights, playing the game. We're not gonna simulate every single game. So, yeah, I'm gonna play the highlights and stuff like that because we really need to get our wins and stuff like that. Um, to to look into the squad, we are not doing the best. We are in eleventh place, and my goal is to get promoted. Promotion is what we got. So first, second, or third promotion. And if we don't get it this season, then we'll try to get it next season. I don't know. We're going to try get, getting it, though. That's our number one goal for Dusseldorf. Remote. So, anyways, let's get to it. And I do want to check one thing, though. What is our other um? What is our other goal? Because I know we have, like, more than one goal. So, objectives. Win the Bundesliga League title, which is possible, okay? Uh, sign two crucial players. No, I cannot do that. I, I really cannot do that. Um... Get five clean sheets in away matches. We could do that probably. And round 16. So we're going to probably play that game so we get that round of 16. Okay. So let's get to it, guys. Um, so in today's episode, who are the teams we got to watch out for? I, I just got to generally figure that out. So the teams we generally got to watch out for, anybody, anybody, literally. I, I don't know who's the best in the Bundesliga 2. So we're going to um, figure that out. So... We're going to play this next game in highlights form. Um, we're going to try to do that. Uh, because this team right here, they're in first in the Bundesliga. I cannot generally see... We're in 14th. Oh, my God. So, yeah. Um, we're going to accept this one. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to accept it. Okay. So, we want to go ahead and get to the top. And Daniel Gaznek is going to leave for Hanover 96. Okay. Okay. Damn damn stats. Okay. So we're fifteenth. I'm not I'm not allowing it. So we're gonna play it. See you guys at the game. Um I think I think I'm gonna yeah, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna We're gonna get to it. Uh see so you guys at the highlight. I'm gonna get to the highlights. There we go. Dizzledorf versus Damn stats. Let's get to it. Um, so we need this one. We generally, they're first in the Bundesliga too. So we want to get promotion. I, I don't care if we get first, second, or third. I just need to see that we, that Fortuna Dusseldorf is the team that's getting promoted next season. The last couple games for us, we have literally just been in a struggling form. Okay, penalty, 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 penalty. All right, let's go for it. Let's go to the left. Let's go. All right, first goal. First goal. First goal return. Kwanaki. Kwanaki. There we go. First return goal. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Two. One. Huh? One thing I love about Bundesliga is the graphics. I really love the, the graphics they use. Cool, 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 cool. Ah, man, oh man. Okay, right. there's another opportunity. Another opportunity for us. All right, all right. All right. 
Still one now. Cool. And we take the win. One nil. <laughs> we did we gonna we finally gonna win in like I don't know, it's been a while, bruh. But we did it. We got a win. Let's go, let's get it. I'll take it. So we're gonna get to our next game and I'll see you guys in a bit. I got two back to back games I'm actually gonna be doing. We're gonna be playing Bielfid. Bielfield. Now here's one thing I've actually noticed. We've been doing well ever since I've been simulating. Like look at this. We won this one. We won we won that one, that one, that one, and that one. So and then everything else we've been losing, I guess, in a way. So that's, that's like whatever. But but we're doing better since I'm noticing. We're gonna play this one, we're gonna play uh the um, yeah, I, I forget the highlights again. I think highlights will make it easier for the videos. So we're going to do that unless I play a full game, which probably would be the Ver Raymond game. So, Caster Slot Sodden is the first. So, when here is going to bump us into competing for the, the title? I don't know. But to get into this, Bielefeld, Dusseldorf, let's get to it. And here we go, guys. This is it. Dusseldorf versus Bielefeld. Here we go. I, I, I mean, personally... I've actually been enjoying it now. I haven't started Letter Curve one, as you guys are noticing. I know I kind of lied to y'all, but I kind of want to get into this a little bit. And maybe we'll try to finish this career mode. This career mode shouldn't be that long, I'm assuming. So, just let you guys know, this career mode wouldn't be that long. This this career mode might end up like nine episodes, because I want to do like an uh, episode of like half a season. So, I think that's the best I can do for career modes at the moment. I don't want to do like a long career mode where it's going to save me a while. Um, because I would love your transfer advice. Don't get me wrong, guys, but I do need to do some other content. And I'm actually debating on bringing some NBA content, so we might bring that into the channel. So, damn. So, it looks like right now we are just tied with the Field. Alright, no, what the hell? Okay. How? Cool. Dusseldorf Karumar. Bro, what the heck, man? And I, I get the foul call because it's my. I had the ball or something. Come on. I see you. I see you. I see you, bro. I see you. I gotcha. <laughs> I don't know who you is. Yohu? Yaha? Yohu? Yoha, we got it. One nil. Let's go. I love those jerseys. Though. Those jerseys are clean. The white one. I wonder how they did in real life. Cause like everything is like the seasons are over and everything like that. So we're not letting. We're not allowing this tie to happen. We're not allowing a tie to happen. Junior R. Manuel Yoho. One nil. Come on. It's another but yell field attack. Didn't they just get relegated like two seasons ago? Oh. And we did it. Another win. Another simple win. We're taking it. Another clean sheet. Let's get it. 1 0 result. We'll take it. Beating these, this team. Easy with the breeze. We're going to get to the Murder Raymond game because that's kind of a crucial one. I'm going to play the whole thing. I'm just going to cut to the important part. So let's get to it. All right, and like I said, the next game was Burger Brayman, so we just cut into it. Um, actually, I just put my play the highlights. We're just gonna play the highlights for it. Makes it easier. So in order, so the, the board doesn't get mad with us, we need to win this game. So we're going to try to get the win here, and then we'll simulate the cup because I do not care about the cup. I don't generally think we're gonna win the cup this season. If we could take a push for it, I will take it, but we're not going for it. So let's get to it, guys. Dusseldorf versus Werder Bremen. Werder Bremen is actually really, really um interesting squad. They used to have Josh Sargent, who used to play as the U.S. national team. I haven't decided what I'm gonna do after a uh, Dusseldorf. Actually, <laughs> I actually was gonna do like a Karuma, like a uh, re rebuild of a, of the country, but I was like, eh, too much work right now. I mean, not too much work right now, but I just want to get into this one um, a little bit, get finish it up maybe. All right, here we go. Bam. Take that. Mm. 
This we need this goalkeeper. I want to keep this goalkeeper for the for the last time. It looks like we're gonna get another a penalty. All right, we're gonna get that penalty, and that penalty is gonna be a literal game changer if we can get this in. This Kawaki, and he gets it in. That's gonna be a game changer for us. Through the door, take the lead. One nil. That is a game changer. We needed this one right here. And the fans are going crazy, the Blue Book fans. Let's get it. The fans are getting crazy. And, uh, Bruce Raymond. Let's go. Let's go. Right. Oh, run. We got a red card at that. I like to be the only one. Mania. 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 55th minute. Good. Good. Good goal. Go. <laughs> Let's get it. Those who go for the red tag. It's a good goal. Hey, if there's an upset here, a bird of brain is going to happen. We will take it. An upset has happened. We're going to the next round, round of 16. Let's go. I mean, that's what we wanted. We're going to figure it a little bit. Get back to you in a bit. See if there's any important games we're going to play. And let's get to it. All right, guys. And now we're facing San Pauli, who are in first place, actually. And it's like, yo, we're struggling in a way. But you know what? We got it. We got it. Okay. So St. Pauli is next. So... Not strong. Why did I say okay? Ignore what I just said. I just been through a lot because I just did all the training, and training pisses me off. Like it literally just kills the mood for me. I'm like I don't want to do the training, but I did it so I can get these guys like the like the, the the bench players to be like, hey, we're happy with me, you know. And that's what we did. So this is the squad we're we're going with uh for this game, and you know what? I got it. I think we got it. So we're facing St. Pauli. We're gonna get to the highlights. Um, is there any more left for the uh? So just December. We're probably gonna. I'm gonna simulate this one. Uh, you'll see the simulation. Um, but yeah. Um, I'm probably gonna play that one and probably Hamburg. Well, I don't know how where Hamburg is and the other other team is. The other team. Uh, okay, Hamburg. Where's Hamburg? Hamburg's in seventh. Okay, we might. We might. We might. Let's get to the game though. St. Pauli, Dusseldorf. Let's get to it. We're taking on Dusseldorf up next. It is um, a real crucial. In a way, it is crucial because the goal, our, our board is like, we need to win the title. And I do want to win that title. I think this is probably the last game for the episode. I'm not going to lie with you. And the thing is, ever since we, like, ever since now, I feel like we've been, like, our team is low key been playing it. Naki. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? Oh my god, that would have been so nice of a goal. Alright, we're going to the 47th minute. One. Come on. St. Pauli got a red card too. 
Please, please, please. Uh, please. Oh my god, how? Good job, good foul. Good, good, good opportunist. All right, and another penalty. Konaki has been scoring every single penalty. <sighs> and the thing is, I'm going to let him score every penalty. And it's going to be to the right, and there we go. Konaki's literally this. <laughs> the game-winning goal, Konaki. <laughs> I don't know if I'm saying his name right, but it, the Polish striker has literally just helped us get another win. This, this team, I've been going crazy. Look at the fans, they're going crazy too. And there you go, that's 2-0 win, Dusseldorf, St. Pauli. What can I say, this team is something. We got the win, let's continue and go ahead and see what's up next for us. Okay, so I don't think I've been showing it you guys, like, what's been going off. Going on? Okay, whatever. So, it's 1-0, 2-0, one, literally, we're on a winning streak since the last game. Um... And guys, I'm not gonna lie, I'm liking this. I'm liking this. This team and it's everything. Like, like I don't know. We need. We're not gonna win this game, but if we win it, hey, I might try to go for the push. I don't. But we're first. It's clear for first. Um, we just need a couple more. I guess like a big gap to confirm. Hey, we're first and stuff. Hamburg is, Hamburg is next. I think. I think I might play that game, and we might call it an episode because that's like the last game. Firth, I'm surprised, are in relegation. They were just in Bundesliga last season, and like now they're like relegation. Like they're fighting for relegation, and I hope they don't get relegated. But I might have to get that win off them. But yeah, look at that. This team, it's gonna be it's gonna be something. So let's get to this Augsburg game actually and simulate it. Um, so here we go. Quick sim, and the result is a two three. <laughs> no, we beat we beat them. Yo. We might have to go for the push. Hey, man, if we win quarterfinals, I'll go for the push. I'll go for the push. But I know no promises, though. I, I didn't expect us to actually make it to the quarterfinals. I thought we would just get eliminated there. But I'll see you guys in a bit for the Hamburger game. Up next, we got Hamburg. It's Hamburger, guys. It's just like, you know, when you eat a sandwich, it's a Hamburger. Okay, let me stop. I don't know if it's Hamburg. I don't know how you guys say it. Okay. Yeah, we're out of the cup. We're out of the cup. Don't worry about it. We're not going for the push. We, I gave up, okay? But yeah, we're playing this game, and then, because I want to get that gap from St. Pauli. Look at this gap, guys. We are kind of, if we win this, we'll be like a 10-point gap, and we really want to, I really want to get that Bundesliga title, bro. Um, I do want to see how we do. So let's get to it. Let's get that quick, uh, get to that matchup, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Here we go. So last game, we beat St. Pauli. We, we did that, but I want to do the same with Hamburg, because Hamburg is the team, uh, they're still third, the so big gap, and like, I think at this point, we got to face the teams who are like in the top 10 at least, not top 10, but like top 7, 5, I don't know, we really got to be looking for that, but we got Bayern next in that super poor cow, we're not winning, we're not winning, I'm not even going to try. I'm not even gonna play it. <laughs> I'm just gonna get that loss because I know we literally haven't lost since we lost to the Caster Caster Cater, whatever the team is called, Casey Flame. I have not checked what does it, how does it go did this season. I actually do want to check how they did this season in real life. Um, bam. Two, one. Mania, Mania. Please. Dude, I really needed you to score right there. Come on, man. Come on, man. Any goal is crucial at this point. Mania, 
Any of me moving it? Please. Matt right there with the game winning goal and he gets the win for us. 1-0. Mania gets that one minute goal, last minute goal. Let's go. And yeah, we take we take that. We take that last minute goal. He's actually really been playing well this season, and that's gonna get us a better win. That's gonna end the episode too. So let's get to the end of this episode and see what's up with the the other results back into the uh so one thing i noticed is that they recalled two of the players who are at loan here which is fine because i didn't even use them and they weren't even going to be used so it happens i mean what i can do what, what's the best i can do i mean we've been doing good with this squad itself i'm like i don't even need anyone else like we could just run it with them so what's up with you guys what's what's next so let's just let's get to it just recap the season a bit. So we're in January, okay? We're in January. Of course, I think we got Yellfield in the bit actually. And it's just this just about transfers and transfers and transfers. I think I forgot to showcase the one transfer that actually happened with the that one guy. I forget his name. It's just it just happened. Um transfer history. It is the this guy right here, Jinzenke. Jinzenke. Uh, he just, we sold him for that much for, yeah, I mean, I don't even remember, like, who we had in this team, not gonna hold you. Um, we had Mania, this was the best, probably, transfer, and then Luis from Junior, who's actually really good this season. And then next season, I don't even know what we're doing next, uh, scouts. So, I don't know what we can do, we gotta figure out what's, what's, who's gonna be good for us next season. I gotta look into that. We need a center back, like ASAP, like center backs. And I'm probably gonna look into that maybe next season or this season, uh, if I can, if I'm enough. Um, or we might just go for the transfer, transfer hub. Um, I might have to hire a new scout who can look into contracts. Uh, it's just gonna be a free agent, so that 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 that's gonna help. In a way, it's going to help because. I guess Jamal, he's a striker, that's a thing. So we might look into, we're just gonna look into him and see if he still become good. But yeah, I think that's really it. I mean, I don't want much really to showcase this episode. We got Bielfiel with the next thing really, and then anyone else who wants to sign and stuff. Um, that's really up to the other teams. I'm not gonna hold you. Um, but yeah, I think that's going to end today's episode, guys. Uh, we've actually had a really, really decent of a, a not enough of an episode that I actually enjoyed it. I, I'm not going to lie. I'm really hyped up for Geek Maggot for this. Um, I don't want to do, like, I'm just going to do, like, half a season for, like, my future career modes probably from now on because it just helps me. Like, it feels, I feel like it'll be more, it makes me more focused in a way, okay? It makes me more focused. Sabatka, so, uh, we're not going to sell anybody, I think. We've been doing good with the team we've had, and I uh, just want to assume they see this Jamal guy. Maybe we can bring him in for next season. So, like, if we have to get rid of Kwanaki. Um, so, just, just look into this a little quick. Okay, Kwanaki, transfer hub. Um, now, <laughs> see, Kwanaki, I got to actually show you guys one more thing about Kwanaki, actually. Uh, after we end it, because I want to get to the Bielfield game and see what's up. Okay, so the one of them went off on loan. All right, Marcel Mansfield. Okay, cool. He went to that six months loan at whatever club that is. Um, and Benjamin Buckle. Cool. All uh, right. So we're about to check. I'm about to show you guys in a bit. Um, Jamie Lewin. Okay, so he's not that bad. I mean. That's our oh crap! I mean, if we can sign him on a free, I'll take him. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I'll, I'll take him.
I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was just looking to that. Um, but yeah, I was just um, searching them up. But yeah, I'm going to end the episode here, actually. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, be a part of Angry Nation. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Yeah, I mean, yeah, we've got much to say. I'm going to try to side uh, Aaron Gleese. And yeah, see you guys next one. Peace out. Bye.